I'm Anil Kumar sharing with you few test questions. Here is a very interesting question. It says, write an equation of a parabola that satisfies each set of conditions. So basically we are going to write two equations, right? The very first one is that the parabola has vertex 2 minus 2 and passes through the point 4, 0. The second one is parabola that opens downwards has vertex 3, 0 and a y-intercept at 0, minus 9. So both are given along with vertex. So we should write the equation in the form y equals to a times x minus b whole square plus q, right? Now, in this equation, the vertex is 2 minus 2. So that makes it y equals to a times vertex at 2. So p is 2 and q is minus 2. x minus 2 whole square minus 2. To find the value of a, we can use the point 4, 0. 4 is the x value, 0 is the y value. So 0 equals to a times 4 minus 2 whole square minus 2. So let's solve for a. Bringing minus 2 to the left side, we get 2 equals to a times 4 minus 2 is 2, 2 square. Or we can write this as a equals to 2 divided by 2 square is 4, so I'm dividing by 4. So that gives the value of a as equal to half. And now we can write the equation as y equals to half x minus 2 whole square minus 2. Correct? So that is how you could get the equation. I hope the steps are clear. Exactly similar steps have to be followed here. So you can actually pause the video now and also solve. So we'll again begin with the vertex form of the equation. We'll write this as y equals to a x. Now what is the vertex? Vertex is at 3, 0. That means minus 3 whole square plus, let me write 0 here. To find the point, I mean a value, we'll use this point which is given to us, the y-intercept. 0 is the x value, minus 9 is y value. So write minus 9 equals to a times 0 minus 3 whole square. That is 0, right? So that is minus 9 equals to a times square of minus 3 is also 9. And that gives you a as minus 9 over 9, which is minus 1. So it automatically gives you opens downwards. You see, I didn't really incorporate that in my equation. But as a result of the points, we get it. So the equation now is y equals to minus x minus 3 whole square. Do you see that? So that is how you should be uh, getting the equation of the parabola from the given description. I hope that helps. Feel free to post your questions, subscribe to my videos, and if you like, put some likes. Thank you, and all the best.